My people, welcome back to Critics News. Wahala know they finish inside the country. <laughs> As I they talk to you now, they say that the school, the American school, with the inside Nigeria, where they collect pupun de wukuneme as a school fees, don't finally return the seven hundred and sixty thousand dollars, almost almost one one billion, Abi? Yeah, almost one million dollars as school fees in advance. <laughs> Where this climber, first climber, we did call uh, Yahaya Bilo, uh, been paid to, to the school for the children in advance because he was leaving the seat of power <laughs> as governor. Now, Rush, go pay this money. You pay this money. Now, and EFCC never do anything. EFCC never catch him. EFCC never even. Never even yes, he said, don't drop the case. <laughs> so make it fat, make this case rest. And the EFCC boss said that, oh, we are going to arrest this guy. We are going to show him. In fact, how can you give such amount of money? Do you know what that means? Do you know the consequences? Do you know this one and that one, my brother? After we hear say if we if they know if we know arrest Yaya Belu say he will resign, all of us were like, ah, oh, wow. If they leave this EFCC man, no, we go really walk. Oh. <laughs> we don't know say na na strategy when the man want to discharge us. We don't know say na scoop the man they scoop us. Now, as I they talk to you now, that case na 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 na. They don't use tie, they sweep them under the carpet. As I they talk now, they don't use tie, they sweep them under the carpet. Don't be be this one. We say if you know if you know arrest him, say you go resign. Don't be the man be this. Oh yeah. Who do? What? Was this your staff? Government cashier. There's cashier. The government house cashier. The guy that was bringing the billions. I'm so passionate about the need for us to move forward in this one. Lie, lie. Is no, you know. Because in most is going. You move money. I mean, the particular of offense is there. It's before court. Go and check it. Apply for our. Processes, please. You will get some of these particulars of offense there. Move money directly from government to bring the change. You see, to pay the the um, child school fee in advance. In advance, dollars. How many? How much? Seventy one. Yes. Total is over almost eight hundred. Hmm? One million. In dollars, yes. In dollars, in seventy-two thousand dollars. Total is about seven hundred twenty thousand dollars. Sorry. Seven twenty thousand in advance. In that day, that was going to leave government house. In a poor state like Kogi, and you want me to close my eyes to that? Under the guise of saying I'm, I'm being used, used by who? At this stage of my life, just by who? By who? For crying out loud! I assumed office here. I didn't. I didn't initiate the case. I edited the case file. I called for the case file, I called for the report, and I said, look, there are issues here. Do you know on my own, on my honor, I put a call across to him, which ordinarily I'm not supposed to do, just to honor him as a governor, as a past, immediate past governor. Sir, there are issues. I've seen this case file. Can you just come? Let, me, let us clarify these issues. Mm. I'm under camera. He said, ah, sir, I thank you, my brother. I know, uh, but I, I can't come. There's one lady, I don't know what her name is. Uh, so let me send it. Uh, that she, she learned she had said, you know, she has surrounded the agency with over 100 journalists, you know, <laughs> to come and embarrass him and intimidate him and all kind of stuff. I said, okay, if that is your fear, I'm going to pass you through my own gate, special man's gate. You will come to my floor. We will accord you that respect. I will invite my operator, operatives. They will come and interrogate you or interview you in my own office. What could be more honorable than that? In my own office. To a lady fear. Ah, thank you, sir. I appreciate that. You know what he said? Eh, but can't they come to my village? Ah. <laughs> That's what he told me. Can't they come to my village to, to come and say? I, I told you. He also got to he, he sent a message to him. My dad of the industry sent a message to him. So we to say we are handing him, we are harassed. How about? Let's be fair on this issue. Look, we need the FCC. We need this institution to survive. We need this institution to survive. 
so many victims that we have wiped tears from their eyes. People that they have swindled and all of that in their millions. Mm. How much are we going to say? Every day we keep recovering money for victims. Every day. In my six months, we have recovered close to 120 billion. Over 1,600 convictions. All right, on another here from the EFCC chairman. <laughs> this one no be Bauer again. We say if you no know arrest, uh, if you no know pro prosecute uh, Yaya Bello, say he go resign. The man still the office now. The money we on they recover from the people we be said in Tifos. Waiting on a take and they do go 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 go. Now waiting I want know. Just imagine waiting on a they use this money they do. Now here what she Kuti have to say concerning Yaya Bello and this looting. And the calculation that this guy made, it shocked, it shocked me to the, it shocked to, it shocked me to my marrows. She here within Shemukuti said about this Yaya Bello. Oh yeah, eighty thousand millions. No, we eight you. Meaning that somebody with eighty billion, 80 billion. can spend one million naira a day. Okay. For eighty thousand days. Ah. Jesus. I want to know who needs this kind of money. Hmm. Is it that you need it? I want to know. So now, one million naira a day. Okay. For hmm. eighty thousand days. Hmm. Eighty thousand days is two hundred and sixty-one years. Hmm. Eighty thousand days is two hundred and sixty-one years. Of spending one million naira every day. Who will leave that? Money? Are you telling me that this person needs this money, or this person just wants to make sure that that money does not use for the betterment of your life? I repeat, you does this person need this money? Oh. Do anybody in their family, all of them combined, do they need all this money? Really, need this money? Or for them, they have to take it so that you don't have it. Which is it? Is it that they really need the money or they take that money to make sure that their people are suffering, to make sure that people are dying, to make sure that people don't have dignity, to make sure that people are useless, okay. to make sure that people don't have a future? That's it. Answer me, is this money taken because it is needed? No. One million naira every day for 80,000 days, mm. for 261 years that mm. nobody alive in his family today will be alive when that kind of money will finish. Even two, two, two generations. Do you need it or you are just so wicked and you have planned with people that hate your people to make sure that your job is to make sure that your people never see that money in their lives? Because you can steal 10 billion. You can steal 5 billion and be okay. You can steal 1 billion and be okay. But you choose 80. There's a reason. I'm not the only bail law. Ladies and gentlemen, we see they following a Mefele drug case. How much they all the use of card they indict them, find them guilty. All these governors. Now, nothing happened to them. Now, so when Ambode come up for governor of Lagos State, and I mean, when Ambode enter as governor of Lagos State, no kind of atrocity, no list against fashion law. So they say they use 100 million naira do only websites. Billions! How? Fashion law became go uh, minister. Meaning that the governor was talking rubbish. Case closed. Or nobody cares. Case closed. These are all the governors in this country. It's an attack on our lives. These people are agents to destroy our lives. They don't need this money. You know what I'm Do you need it? You don't need this money. Oh, now they hear analysis here. We be say shock. It shocked me. It shock. It don't. It don't bring shock waves to my system. When one person loot, who I'm being, they they nothing they happen or nothing they happen. This one not the one where they just find where we say they, as they just one pack come up for government house. Now if we pick round them up, take the rest now go pay school fees from the 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 people's treasury. I don't know how we are going to survive in a country like this Nigeria. So I don't know. And divide the country too. That one now war. Once they hear them for your mouth, <laughs> eh, 
Mshuti, go, go, go. Because this second of Nigeria, na pipe, na, na hunger, na starvation, na tifre, looting, na they want to take everybody inside. But now, they want to take and poof everybody. But now, they go, they loot. See, I have been. They loot. Money when generation, no be two generation be 200 years. No be two generation be that. We one person, they loot. They loot for two generations. You are looting it. Now, person we won't become president before he wanted to contest as a president. During Buhari stay no, if nobody can say, oh, this is waiting Buhari don't carry come out. All the abacha loot when we they recover, we know they see waiting they, they take and do. EFCC don't come tell us now, say, ah, see you, eh, we have recovered over 100 and billions. Where is that money? We do not they use and do. The time we not never recover them, we still day. The time we not recover them, we still day. But no single improvement in our lives. So I don't know. I bet more than me share this video. I just tired. Anyways, they say don't again. The school don't return the money to the EFCC. Now pump pony on you. It is still useless because it will not benefit the country. It will not benefit the common man. It will only benefit the pocket of one person or two, or three, or they share them among themselves, case closed, and will continue to lament, complain, and uh, um, people continue to attack you, and uh, tell you that uh, you're not going to go somewhere. <laughs> okay. Meanwhile, politicians are looting. Will you be an honor in your own case day for court? We don't have four billion. Although, when we hear all this kind of big money from the likes, likes of uh, Yaya Bello, we will begin to underrate that of four billion when we will be a not if a number of things. We think it's small money, but not be small money. You they see, you can't say, ah, if that one said, because even she himself was like, why not if, even if not 10 billion and leave rest of a, a 70 something billion for the country, for the state? Even if you leave them there, what, what impact is it going to make in the lives of the people? Even if EFCC today recovers all the money from Yaya Bello, what is the impact on the lives of the people? Nothing. If both who recovered and who looted, they are on the same scale, equal scale, no impact on the lives of the people. The money is just as useless. The country is just as useless. Our government has rendered the country useless for us. It no longer benefits us. Everybody now they hustle to survive on their own. Meanwhile, a country was created to 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 cater for the whole people. But now if the country no longer caters for the citizens, the citizens now are, are the ones catering for the country. Why these thieves loot as they wish? I bet let me touch the share button. And the only thing we fear me do be that. We'll go another news. Thank you.